Hey everybody, welcome to a Clickstaff unboxing and sealed advice video um, for Spider-Man Beyond Amazing Marvel Hero Clicks. Thanks to WizKids for sending uh, Clickstaff this package. Um, going to do a couple of videos here. First one's going to be the unboxing of the brick. Uh, then we've got the two play at home kits and the mini game. Going to do a little bit more close up review, especially some of the new terrain that we're getting. Um, that's kind of what I'm interested in seeing in those two, um, or those three boxes there. So, um, I want to give out, uh, some sealed advice. Uh, Sam and I talk about what teams we would build. We did this last time. Uh, at this point, the whole set's been revealed. So there's nothing too crazy dial wise to review. Those are all been posted and Still such. Still new to me though. Cause Still new to Sam. She, uh, I'm just too busy to. Too busy. So this is, if you're too busy, to look at the dials and you're going to a release day sealed event this week. This is as real uh, as it gets. This is as real <laughs> as it gets. So uh, first of all, we'll take a little peeky here at what's in our legacy card. And it is the sixth arm Spider-Man from Clobbering Time. Cool. So you wouldn't be playing him in sealed. So, um, we'll just kind of do, I mean, you know, you we can shuffle them up, whatever. I'm just going to pick two at random, this one, this one, and this build one a, and this one? we're going to build a 300 point seal team out of these two boosters, much like you would get at a release day event. Uh, talk about what's in the boosters. And Iron Spider. The Iron Spider, the super rare. Super rare. Let's see. I got... Matt Murdock, Aunt May, Chameleon, uh, Daredevil, The Punisher in that one, and in this one, I got... Oh, well, you're going to win this one because you have Venom. I got Venom. Venom is good. Uh, J. Jonah Jameson, Miles Morales, Spider-Woman, and Craven the Hunter, so... Um, well, I no super rares or primes or chases. I got a broken hobgoblin. Broken hobgoblin. Well, that doesn't affect how well he plays in sealed. So broken hobgoblin. We got these new hints cards, and I may very well need these hints uh, based on what I pulled here. So um, with uh, shock gauntlets. Oh, well, that's going to be good. Um, with boomerang miles morales aunt may and spider gwen so the the shot gauntlets are going to be really good with um and then in my first booster i got iron spider yeah dr strange that's the a right the regular super rare is it like 547a or so 47a yeah it's not the prime uh prowler sandman and uh mary jane so let's see. These new cards are something to get used to. Yeah, I know, it's, right? Uh, it's all on the front, so I keep turning it over thinking, okay, I gotta look at the dial that's Punisher. like right there. Oh man, this is a chameleon. We don't have to worry about theme team anymore. Not <laughs> not not to get access to prob, right? It still gives Which, you the it still gives you the ability to you know, control the map. But... I tell you what, though, when we played Thursday, mm -hmm. I missed that. Like, yeah. I didn't know that I would miss that as much. But you know, you think you like build a little steam team. You have a couple of props at your hand. Nope, that was just out of the gate, and it was right. not a lot of problem in this set from what I could see. Right. So I think Matt with his perplex is Matt Murdock with his perplex is really good. Um, I enjoyed Spider Woman with her perplex. You have to play Venom because um, Jason played Venom. With the super senses? He's really hard to take down, right? I did 14 damage before you knocked to him kill out. the Venom. Yeah, and then you've got, we've got plenty of perplex here. I mean, we got Jay Jonah. He stands out to me. Um, the Punisher stands out to me. Uh, Chameleon doesn't. Aunt May might be just a, Aunt May might just be a filler. And Craven is an outwit, but I think my first team, let me do some math, 75 and Spider-Woman 75, that's 150. 
200 with Venom, 225, 255, and I've got 45 points left potentially. That gives me room for another Daredevil for a little bit more oomph, or I could use the Chameleon for an Outwit. Um, that also gives a Wild Card. It also gives Sinister Syndicate Wild Card, which I think Venom has that, so I think that's the play. So my 285 point team would be Matt Murdock Common 006 for the Perplex. J. Jonah Jameson, 002 for the Perplex. Uh, and of course, Matt Murdock, um, you know, they can't be positively modified when you target an opposing character. And then Venom comes in as a big attacker. Spider Woman comes in as a big attacker and Perplex. Punisher is a great attacker. And then Chameleon will give Venom wild card and himself wild card so that they can copy. Uh, the Spider-Man team ability, um, the Punisher has wild card, and Masters of Evil, uh, which helps lower um, target defenses up close. Um, so I think that's probably about as good as you're going to get with this team. A lot of perplex, you've got an outwit, you've got some really strong attackers, and you've got a lot, a lot, a lot of super senses on the team. So I don't know, it doesn't seem super strong in general, but it's a lot of diversity, a lot of attackers, a lot of things to chew through, uh, a lot of abilities to hit the super senses. And you know what? I've got 200, I got I got Aunt May too, Aunt May. Um, she fits in there just fine, uh, point wise. Cool. So we were playing seven of my 10 figures in my first two boosters. So I just went with, I'm a straight 300. I am not playing the shot gauntlets, because I've been up it. It doesn't seem, it doesn't I seem right. Know, like, Probably not the best, but I just went for straight 300 because I thought I'll play with the super rare hobgoblin. Um, obviously, because. Oh, know, you got both, two super rares? Yeah, I got iron hobgoblin and iron spider. Oh, wow. So I'm going to play with the two super rares hobgoblin and iron spider. I feel like those are just two legit pieces. I mean, iron spider looks like it's going to be a good attacker. 12 attack with shape change. Yeah. Um, Mary Jane's going to give him a prog. That's good. So I'm going to be able to have her front That's prom. almost a must play. And then I'm playing Boomerang because I feel like he's a good running shot. Now are you playing him at full or half? Half. No, full. Full? Full. So you got another prob. Got another prob, yeah, full. Another prob, running shot, 11 attack with... Uh, when he attack, when he would miss a range attack by two or less. He may re-roll that attack roll. So he's got another re-roll. So he's got another re-roll on top of his So I mean, problem. with with no thinking props, it's one of those like I feel like he prob. Right. So Boomerang's just another attacker, and then Prowler is just a good little, you know, charge sidestep stealthy kind of guy that can go in there with some uh, blades. Exploit, wait, ex and blades. Right? And blades. Yeah. Um, so we got two probs, two good attackers. Or three good attackers. Three good attackers, a couple and props. Were, yeah, I think that's super Prowler's strong. Prowler's got some stealth, so he can kind of stay back and stealthy and then go in with exploit weakness. Right. So. Then you got your super senses. You got some sinister syndicate. Mm -hmm. Um. So I think you'd be in good shape. Yeah, I figured out that's a straight 300. So. All right. In my next two. Dun, 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 dun. Go for the front two. And then our last two boosters. It's like prize boosters at the end. Yeah, our last two would be our prize boosters, right? So, uh, nothing too high rarity in there. The Inguin Hulk. Oh, the Inguinable Hulk? Inguinable Hulk. Ooh, well. Yeah. Ooh, this is coming to a little bit dead. Uh, oh. Yeah. Oh. So, my booster, my this seal team is going to be pretty straightforward, I think. I got police officer, <laughs> spiderling, <laughs> hand ninja, rhino, Morbius with its Morbin time, uh, Mary Jane, spiderling, bullseye, hand ninja, and the big guy. He was so fun to play Thursday. You got him and you pulled him in seal. We've got him in this brick. Venom Thanos. So I don't think he's meta. I don't I mean, think he's, he's he needs a lot of support. 
Yeah. Like, he's really good, but, like, his pick and power thing, like, you can be defensive, but when you be offensive, like, you go all in, there's no prob. You're kind of just stuck in the water. Right. Uh, so I got the Chase, the Inglendable Hulk. I got Scorpion, which, by the way, I've not seen Scorpion's sculpt, but that's, like, Looks really good, pretty doesn't good. it? Pretty mm good. -hmm. The uh, sculpts in this set have been really great. Speed um, Demon. I got Mr. McTellic Hydro Man. Yeah, I really like the I really like the paint on the Hydro Man as well. Um, and I was informed um, that Hydro Man and Sandman are not the same person. Just in case you didn't know. Yeah, I think they're different. Yeah, they're different. They're different. I know. I'm saying they are different. You're saying that's just what I found out. Well, one turns into sand. One turns into water. I don't know. I just figured it may have like water and sand. It turns into like. Mud man? Hard rockish stuff. Like, isn't that how they defeat Sammy and kind of? I guess. I don't know. Um, <laughs> the people are going to love this. Yeah. <laughs> I just, Start I sending us. Oh, so yeah. Well, I tell you what, we did get some good support for Venom Thanos. We've got a Mary Jane with her prob, so those hits can land. Um, oh, I wish I had that Thursday. Yeah, there you go, right? And then, but that leaves us only with 30 points. Um, so, I mean, that, we're I mean, going, I feel like I gotta play that out of it. Where it feels like we're going all in on Thanos, which is probably fine. Um, because you can use the last, so 15, okay, 20 so and 15 is 35. That leaves us with 15 more, so we can't do that. We didn't get an Aunt May. So I think we just go Venom Thanos, Mary Jane, police officer, and have Mary Jane help Venom Thanos land his attacks. <sighs> yeah. So if I know that I'm playing against the Venom Thanos. Well, you don't know that. You, well, you well, might just, you might I be just, able to look around the room. I just say if I see the Thanos. Right. You might be able to look do around. Do not pick a ranged piece to go against him because. <laughs> Right, well, he's, he's got like, the symbiotic fusion Well, yeah, and he's going to be coming up in your face and hypersonic punching you for exploit. Well, I mean, and you then, pulled the Inguendable Hulk, so... Yeah, I'm going to play the Inguendable Hulk. Definitely going to play Scorpion. Definitely going to play Speed Demon. So that's... 100. That's 225 of my team right there. Yeah. So I got 75 points. I mean... Um, let's see. Police officer just is just okay. Um, he's got PD, so he'd be good for ranged pieces. Mm -hmm. You probably um, want to see if you got any Masters of Evil. So I got a black cat here. It's got a prob. But she's got prob, and she stop turns off opposing probs. Yeah. Oh, that is right, black cat. So if they come up, yeah. Um. Let's say says leadership. So that's two sixty-five. Mm-hmm. So that leaves you thirty-five points. So I think I just play Sibio. Yeah, um, he's just another good attacker. He's just another good attacker. So I have four attackers with Black Cat to take down Venom Thanos. Oh, Venom Thanos. Mary Jane and a police officer. Well, I'm not worried about them. Mostly you just Whoa, think every attack. Whoa, got, has got what, like ten for ten for three? Yeah, he's like he's a no, he's eleven for three. He's got range combat expert. No, he's not. He's a nine attack, so he's oh, ten for three. Well, yeah, ten for three. That's fine. Okay. I mean, but then he, but then if you click him, well, I mean, if he gets injured, like he gets an empower. He gets an empower. So he gets he an empower to help get Venom Thanos' uh, damage up there a little bit. So I'd be all about just wheeling. That's fine. So we've played all night. We've come into the three rounds. Here's my rare. Here's your here's our prize boosters. Here's my rare. Let's see what we got in our prize boosters. <laughs> my second booster was a bunch of oh the rare. It wasn't much in there. Right. So when we, we pulled a chase in three super rares, so I got uh, Mysterio, Daredevil, Mr. Negative, Moon Knight, and Spider-Man. 
So we got Electro, Spider-Man, A Common, Bullseye, Hand Ninja, and J. Jonah Jameson. I did get some Billy Clubs, though. And a Billy Clubs. That's probably the real... There we go. Billy that's that's is really the prize good. right there. <laughs> so a couple of notes on the sculpts. Right, We talked about Hydro Man. Mm -hmm. Show off the Electro. Or, I'm sorry, a Mysterio. Uh, Mysterio. Mysterio. And I'll show off the Electro. Uh, Mysterio is, like, legit. So... I mean, it's... Electro is awesome. If you Mysterio. really like get to look at him, you actually see like there's a face in there. Yeah, I don't know if I can bring I mean, it up here. It's like so... detailed. I really like the sculpts this time. It's yeah, yeah, super great. Iron then... Spider was actually a good sculpt too. Right, and I also like this that we get these back, the checklists, in the boosters. Super awesome! I'm loving, I'm loving that. I'm loving the hint ones that they have the they have the QR codes on them. I think for you to scan to go like I go love to, the I love well, the on checklist. the other side of the hint page, right? There's a QR code. Yeah, the QR code. Right. Let me see the Iron Spider. Oh. Ooh, Iron Spider. Iron Spider. I love the checklist because no going back and looking out like out online and see what you're missing and whatnot. Right. Just keep that. Um. And let me see, you got your Hydro Man handy? Hydro Man, Hydro Man. I mean, these people probably aren't seeing this stuff, but it's really cool. These well, they may not have. That's why these, we're showing it off. These sculpts are really neat. I mean, I had a lot of fun playing Thursday. And then let's see our Inguindable Hulk as well. So, the, so Venom Thanos, super great sculpt. Love that one. Love the energy orb. The metallic paint on the Hydro Man is awesome. Love that. I mean, even, I mean, here's the here's the chase. But when you're looking chase. at, like, I'm looking here at Mr. Negative, and you're like, okay, this is like, you know, a guy that's, you know, all dark with a white suit. And if you really look at him, I mean, the, the, the detail in the face. Yeah. It's like, you can actually see. It's really, really nice. Yeah, I mean, um, you know, new sculpt sizes were released with House of X, and I feel like they've just gotten better and better every set with this. So. I really yeah. haven't seen any that are have been just like a messed up face or, you know, no. a oh. three eyed or. No, I think they've been really great sculpts um, as well. It was a fun set to play Thursday, for sure. Yeah. Like. And we did our pre-release, so. I mean, I played Venom Thanos. So right, you played Venom Thanos. <laughs> so. I got to pick some powers and. Uh, any final thoughts? No, I literally like the set. I can't wait to like dive into it more. Me too. Well, thanks everybody for watching. Check the next few videos that we've got. I want to check out these terrain pieces. These terrain pieces, I think, define the meta immediately when Spider-Man mm -hmm. releases. More to come on that. Thanks everybody for watching. We'll talk to y'all next time.